Hey guys, what's going on? Coming with you with my July haul. So for the month of July, I have to tell you, a um, little rough month for me. So I didn't do a lot of shopping. Um, so I, but I did pick up a few items, but nothing too crazy. So I'm just gonna share with you the few items that I did pick up. So first thing first, I know Bath & Body Works, Victoria's Secret been having a sale. I finally decided to go to Bath & Body Works and literally I went for soaps. I picked up six soaps, um, Italian lavender, I can tell you. I got two of the peach bellini. I also got two of the black cherry malo. And I also got the turquoise water so I got six so that's pretty much all I got I didn't get any candle because I still have like two candles left it takes me forever to burn candles so usually if I buy like three or four pretty much lasts me through the year because I don't burn them as much so that was it I'm gonna share with you some pieces of items that I got from Nordstrom Rack so I did pick up two J. Crew sweaters from Nordstrom Rack. And this one is this bright red. Love it. And the other one I picked up is this bright fuchsia kind of color. And again, this is J. Crew. The brand is J. Crew, and this is from Nordstrom Rack. Now, Nordstrom is, has their anniversary sale going on. Um, yeah, I got annoyed with that because there was a couple items that I wanted, but I have to tell you, they sold out so quickly. And I even got, because I have the card, so I got to shop earlier before everybody else, and they were just all, like, they just sold out. Most of the stuff, of course, was like more like that, you know, leopard cheetah print, the snake skin print. I mean, the stuff that I really, really wanted sold out. There's some other stuff that I have in my car. I've still been deciding if I'm getting anything or not because I was kind of annoyed. So we're just going to leave that as that. And again, back to print. As you know, that snake, snake skin print is very big this year. Now, I don't have too much. Actually, I only have one thing that is snake skin print. And that's a pair of flats that I literally got probably like two years ago. But I did pick up this body icon dress from Amazon. I seen somebody with it on and I was like, oh, this is so pretty. Now I'm five foot one. So this literally leads like a little above, no, over my knees, over my knees, cause it's pretty long. So if you're taller, but I just love it. So just to keep up with the trend, again, beautiful dress. Got this from Amazon. So very happy about that. Love the fit. Um, you do know Amazon, some of these clothes, you got to size up because they do run different. Let's just say that. And the next stuff is, oh, I picked up one pocketbook from Neiman Marcus Last Call. And this is the Zach, Zach Posen bag. And this is considered like the medium. So last year I brought a, a mini and I thought it was this size because you know it looks so deceiving online but when I got the bag it was so small that my iPhone 7 at the time could not even fit in the bag and now I have the iPhone 10 so I end up returning it and then this year I decided to get this one which is considered the this is the Eartha top handle crossbody in ivory and this size is perfect I just love this side and I just love the colors I thought this was so cute. And again, this is from Neiman Marcus, last call. And they were actually in sale. I think it went down to like two something I think I got it for. So this is the spot. And of course, I did pick up a few items from Pink, Victoria's Secret. That I can say I really did enjoy. I picked up they had 10 for 35 underwear i got 10 for 35 plus i had a coupon to get a free one so i actually end up with 11 not that i need any more underwear but hey why not um i did pick up a hoodie i'm getting ready for my favorite season which is the fall so it looks like this it's just black and white has gray to the side i picked up this top
Oh, I picked up this. This is one of my favorites. It's like this plain, you know, white shirt. And then I love the back. Back is so pretty. And I picked up some sweats, of course. Had to pick up a pink one. Kind of like joggers, more like. And I also picked these up in black as well. So I did this side and the band also says pink on here. And so this one I could wear my black hoodie. And this one I could wear on any one of my tops. And again, this band also has the pink. So that's it for Victoria's Secret. And the last stuff, of course, is I did pick up few makeup items not a lot i just got my kate somerville um detox daily cleanser this is one of my staple items so this is just a rebuy and another rebuy is the dr brennett pours no more another rebuy anastasia beverly hills liquid lipstick in ashton love this one so the one that i have is dry so i needed a new one and oh another rebuy that i was about to complain about is so i end up getting the nars um coconut groove eyeshadow i've been waiting for this eyeshadow to come back in stock it's been out of stock for a while now i don't know if you guys remember this is the eyeshadow that i love that i use to fill in my brows so it's one of my favorite eyeshadows now back then it used to come i still have this old packaging because when i get them they last me a very very long time now this is how big the eyeshadow used to be i don't want to tilt mine because i have some broken pieces going on and i'm almost done with this so i guess this is the new packaging which is that sleek packaging which is fine but this is the eyeshadow you have this tiny little eyeshadow now again this will last me a while because i really only use this to fill in my brow but i was kind of disappointed i don't know i think i like the old packaging better because this whole thing was filled with eyeshadow so now we're down to this but i have to get a backup because like i said it's been sold out for a while i don't know what's going on at first i thought they were going to discontinue it but i was so happy to see that they restock it so we'll see then i got from and the, oh this stuff came from sephora by the way i did get a olay hankerson this is the banana bright eye cream the sea rush brighten gel cream and the collagen booster truth serum it's one of those like codes that they send you depending on how much you purchase you add the code and i was able to get this also i traded in a few points because i had like over two thousand points i still have over two thousand points i've been hearing a lot of good things about what is this brand i think it's first a beauty so i'm trying the coconut skin smoothie primer moisturizer this was 100 points and i've been wanting to try from that brand pharmacy with the f and this is their honey potion mask hydrating mask so i've been wanting to try this so and then so two three new buys well three new things um I finally decided to try the Huda Beauty, the Overachiever Concealer, and I got it in Caramel Corn, and this is really just to use it under my eye. And then I finally picked up one of the Huda Beauty lipsticks in Ladies Night, which is, love the packaging, very beautiful. I love this color. I mean, this is what burgundy, any type of deep red or deep burgundy or deep, like, reddish purple reddish pink fuchsia those are like my type of colors and i wear them all year long and this is actually the color i have on now it's a little lighter because i had this on since about 7 30 this morning so but this is the color it's beautiful i just really really love this and last but least something that was on my list for a while since it came out i finally decided to pick it up because i remember i said i wanted to try it in the summertime and this is the dior backstage face and body foundation and I am trying out the 4.5W. It was between that or the neutral, but so far so good. Actually, this is what the bottle looks like. And I like it. I actually have the foundation on today. And I had it on again. I did my makeup since this morning before I went to work. So I've been wearing this makeup since about 7, about 7 a.m. So I like it. I thought it's okay. And I actually think it's a good match so i'm gonna play around with it some more just to make sure but so far so good 
But again, this is it. I mean, besides some hair stuff, which I totally forgot to include in this video, but you know, whatever. I restock. And but other than that, this was it. Again, July um was a tough month for me and my family, but we're dealing and we're getting better. So that's why I said quick short haul. Just wanted to share with you guys, and I will see you in August. You guys take care and see you soon.